What is going on guys? I'm back with another video. I hope all of you guys are having an amazing day. I hope all of you guys are all safe out there. And in this video, I'm going to bring to you guys a little something a little bit different. Um, I announced that I was going to be doing me against my subscribers. And I just made a clan and chose the first five people that joined my clan. As you guys can see here. Um, Peter, Dar, Jar, Jar, Little B, Eric's and Gold, and Freddy. So yeah guys, I am going to be playing against my subscribers today as you guys can tell. Lester versus subs. But yeah guys, um let me know if you guys want to see a part 2 if you didn't get a chance to join the clan. I chose the first 5 people like I said and yeah guys, um I'm going to be versus my subscribers today and good luck to all of you guys that are playing against me. It's just something to spice things up a little bit, you know, and yeah guys, um but before we hop on to some matches against my subscribers, if you guys are new here talking about subscribers, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Help me reach a thousand subscribers. Let's end 2020 on a high note, guys. Come on, a thousand subscribers is the next goal. So let's get it, guys. And other than that, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys do, please make sure to leave a like. And like I said, leave it down in the comments if you guys want to see a part two of this. And yeah, guys, let's get on to the first match. Um, I'm going to tell Freddy to to hurry up because yeah we talked about this in the beginning freddy's going first um darth jar jar is going second um peter's going third kill wait little b is going um fourth and erickson's going fifth i think so freddy send it now freddy send it i'm ready so yeah guys i also prepared five decks for five decks for each and one i'm going to start with this golem deck guys Let's get it guys. Let's get on to our first opponent, Freddy. Let's give him the good luck. And let's see what is my man Freddy gonna bring at me today, guys. But yeah, this is just something, you know, to show love to my subscribers, man. Just to have a little bit of fun play against my subscribers. But let's hop on to the first match, guys, against Freddy. Let's see if he's gonna be able to destroy Lester CR. <laughs> But yeah, guys, Um, let me know if you guys want a part two. Like I said, maybe you guys can be in my next video of this. Yeah, but yeah, like if you didn't get a chance to join this time, maybe you guys can join next time. But that baby D got a little bit of damage on the right side, which is what we like to see. Now he's going to drop off a Barbara, but we can drop off Ice Wizard. So it looks like he's going to have um Expo deck, right? Or, or wait, he has Archers, Knight, Bar Barrel. So maybe this can be, I don't know what deck. Yeah, he has... Maybe, oh, okay. It's going to be a balloon deck, but we can lining that thing down ASAP. And then we can barber on top of the miner, even though the bomb is going to explode on top of the barbarian. We don't care. The miner is going to go down even quicker. And right now, my subscriber, Freddy, is actually beating me. Whoa. <laughs> but yeah, guys, um, this man is going to have that balloon deck with Mega Minion Bomb Tower, right? If I'm not mistaken. But yeah, let's just play a Dark Prince in the back. So he has Bomb Tower, baby. Wait, Bomb Tower, Mega Man, and Archer, Snowball, if I'm not mistaken. So maybe we can break through in Double Electric, guys. We just have to wait and see. He's still going to have to defend that Dark Prince, I believe, right? He's going to charge to the tower. Oh, it didn't charge, but it's all good. Let's start off a Golem because we are approaching Double Electric time. And he might drop off a Balloon here. Yes, he is. He's going to go with the Balloon. But guess what, guys? I'm going to ignore that balloon as at his finest there. I'm not going to touch that balloon whatsoever. He's going to take out my tower, but now we can line him down his bomb tower. And yeah, guys, we can line him down that bomb tower. The balloon's not even going to take out our whole th three crown, right? I hope the balloon doesn't take out our three crown. But <laughs> yeah, we can line him down the bomb tower on um, the night. And it looks like he... This guy's... Oh, my God. Yep. Am I going to lose against this guy? <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God, man. Well played, bro. Well played, man. Yep. I am not playing so good right now. I think I should have not ignored that. I should have not ignored that thing, but it's all good, you know. So, yeah. Ice Wizard is going to destroy that knight, I believe. And he's going to go with Balloon right away. Oh, my God. This guy is crazy, man. But, yeah. We need to tornado that Balloon or else the Balloon's going to 3 crown us there. But, yeah. With 20 seconds left, there is nothing I can do in this match. We just lost our first match against my subscriber, Freddy. Right? Because, yeah, that baby D's not going nowhere close to that. Yeah, GG's, guys. Yo, good game, Freddy. Good game, brother. Good game, man. <laughs> that lining was horrible against that bomb tower. But, hey, we we don't pick up a nice dub against Freddy. But, hey, I'll give him the good luck, you know. I mean, the good game. 
let's move on to the next one guys and yeah guys this is what it's all about you never know look at his personal best was i don't know what it's four thousand or what's up yeah look at that oh my god but hey and 1v1s the card levels are the same which sucks but it's all good ggs ggs yes sir so yeah guys erickson can't believe it i don't know how i lost that match but let's hop on to the next one which is gonna be um darth jar jar right yeah darth next but yeah darth oh my god freddy yo freddy if you're watching this good game man good game i really appreciate you joining today and i hope you oh my i forgot to change my deck what am i doing <laughs> oh my god it's all good guys we're gonna use this deck again i guess because I forgot to change my deck. Oh my god, bro. But it's all good, you know. Let's cycle the printing. What is this man Darth Jar gonna have? Yo, guys. Am I gonna lose all my matches for me against subscribers? No way. If I lose all my matches against me against subscribers, that's gonna be pretty funny to watch for you guys. But I don't think I'm gonna lose all my matches, bro. I don't know how Freddy won me. Oh my god. Maybe that. Maybe ignoring that balloon and. Maybe ignoring that balloon push was horrible. But it's all good, guys. You know, we can bounce back, you know. Maybe be Darth. <laughs> but what kind of deck is this guy running? So, I'm going to go pretty aggressive here since he dropped off his giant. I ain't going to lie about that. Yeah, I'm going to go Golem right here. He's going to say wow, right? Or like, what did he say? Good luck or something. But, yeah, the Night Witch and the Golem are... It's going to take out his whole tower. And let's see what he has for this um giant. Ooh, he's going to have to... He's going to support that with the Ice Wizard. Okay. Drop off Prince for that Electro Wizard. And we can even Tornado the Miner to our King Tower, right? Yes, sir. Tornado the Miner to the King Tower. We are not looking in a good spot after he played, played that Prince. And that Prince is going to go directly to the Barbarian there. But at least my King Tower is going to help out on that Prince to to kill it even faster. Not to take out my whole tower right there. But yeah, guys, we can drop Golem in the back right now and just wait. Just settle down, you know? We can even go for the three crown, but yeah, I don't know if I should go for the three crown or two crown. Let's go for the three crown, guys. I'm greedy today. I am. I feel. I'm feeling greedy today. And yeah, he's also gonna decide to go for our left tower because he got more damage there. But let's try to stop his go his giant push with our night witch and our and all of our supporting cards like the dark prince, ice wizard. Yep, he's also gonna have a dark prince of his own, but that's all good. We can drop off ice witch to ice wizard to slow down the giant and the dark prince even faster and that was well played on his end bro that was wait that was well played on his end because that was a good prince on his end man i ain't gonna lie about that that was a good prince but yeah i believe now that we just three crown the living crap out of them <laughs> oh he has fireball oh my god he surprised me with that fireball but yeah we just need to drop off another prince the baby dragon golemites are on the tower electro wizard is going down and at this point as and, and at this point i'm just spamming any cards right now man I'm just spamming any cards, but I don't know if it's working, guys. Is it working or no? I don't think it's working. Yeah, it's not working, right? Yeah, the baby dragon doesn't even take out the tower. Am I going to lose again? No way. No way am I going to lose again, boys. But yeah, I ain't going to lie. That prince was a little bit bad on his end, man. I ain't going to lie about that. That prince was bad. We can bar barrel, but the giant's not going to... The giant's not going to deal enough damage to take out my whole tower. We can drop off a golem to the three crown. The baby dragon. Oh, I thought the baby dragon was going to lock onto the tower, but it's all good. We can lining down everything he puts at us right now. Wait, he, never mind. He's going to put miner. Yeah, the miner doesn't do enough, but let's tornado this just in case. Oh, he's going to have to fireball now. Oh my god. It, am I going to lose against all my subscribers, bro? Oh my are all my subscribers better than me? <laughs> oh my god, guys. Yo, I forgot to change my deck. Mm. Damn, bro. I shouldn't use another deck, but it's all good. Wait, look, what deck was he rocking there? He was rocking. Yeah, double prince, man. I could have probably, but it's all good. Let's change to this hog rider deck. Peter's next. So, Peter is next, guys. Let's battle Peter and let's hope we can win some matches i don't know if we can bro but are my subscribers better than lester cr man yo i'm supposed to be better than all of them now nah, i'm just playing these yo it looks like these guys doesn't it it seems like these guys don't don't have talent but hey on now they're good at the game guys calm down 
Just because they have low trophies doesn't mean they're not good at the game. Calm down, you know. They're beast. Yeah, he's going to drop off Mini P.E.K.K.A. Giant. What kind of deck is this guy running, man? Please kill that Mini P.E.K.K.A. Oh, my. That Mini P.E.K.K.A. is not going to die, right? That Mini P.E.K.K.A. Yeah, that Mini P.E.K.K.A. is going to be on 1 HP. Oh, my. And it, if the Mini P.E.K.K.A. kills the Wizard. Okay, I was about to say. Whew. But, yeah, how am I losing against my subscribers, man? That's... Do I want to fire by the pump? Yes, I do. Let's fire by that pump just so he won't get enough elixir. Or, or more elixir than he wants to. We can log that prince back once it charges. And the, and the E-Wiz. And that E-Wiz should only get off two shots. Wait. Wait. Yeah, only one shot because of Skarmie. And we can play Skarmie on top of that giant. Demolish that giant. And right now, we are finally looking in a good position, guys. Right now, against Peter. Um, Peter is running a giant poison. I mean, not giant poison. He's running giant um, pump. But yeah, we can drop off Knight once that wizard crosses the bridge. Just to stop that in his tracks. Drop off a Knight behind the wizard now. And then we can actually drop off a Hog Rider behind our Knight just to tank. He He's most likely going to go with Mini P.E.K.K.A. Yep, there's that Mini P.E.K.K.A. And right here, what do I want to do? Drop off Giant Skelly or Wizard? I'm going with Wizard. I'm going to trust on this Wizard, man. If the Wizard doesn't kill the Mini P.E.K.K.A., then I'm never using that card again. Ooh. Oh my god. <laughs> That's what I was saying, boys. I'm not using the wizard again. Never, ever, ever. But at least I can fire by down the pump. And yeah, guys. We can giant skeleton in the back once he decides to drop off his giant. Because he's most likely going to drop off his giant in the back. He he's going to have Sparky. Okay. So we can giant skeleton in the back. Start off a big push right now. Or yeah. Get ready to defend, I wanted to say. Get ready to defend. He's going to come at us with everything, bro. Giant, Sparky, Wizard, Dark Prince. But yeah, we can just tornado everything together to the bomb. Oh my, that tornado was so horrible. Oh, bro, is it just me or am I playing horrible today, bro? Am I playing horrible today just because it's my subscribers? What am I doing? But yeah, we can predict this mini P.E.K.K.A. right now. Boop! And that mini P.E.K.K.A. should go down right by the Wizard. Yes, sir. Hog is going to get in there and get off one more shot. We can drop off Giant Skeleton and Knight. And we can drop off a Skarmy ASAP once that, once that Giant gets closer to my tower. And with 10 seconds left, there is nothing my man Peter can do. Yo, Peter, thank you for that match. Finally, I win a match against my subscribers. He's going to try to predict my... He's going to try to protect his tower with the, with the Electric Collector. But that won't, that won't do it. And just like that, guys, we pick up our first game against our subscribe, my subscribers, bro. So, Peter, thank you so much for joining. And let's get on to our next game, which is, um, let's get on to our next game, which is going to be, um, Little B, I believe. So, let's play this Hog Hunter Earthquake deck and let's see if it's good, man. So, who's next, bro? Little B's next, right? Little B, where are you, man? Where are you, Little B? Come on, bro. It's your turn, man. You are featuring on the Lester CR video, man. Come on, man. <laughs> There's Little B. Let's give Little B the good luck. And let's see if we can pull out another win against my subscribers, man. Um, Hog Rider to start off the match. And Earthquake. What do you have? Tornado? Yeah. We can Earthquake that Goblin King any day of the week. And it looks like he's most likely going to have Log Bay deck. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah. With that... With the knight and the goblin gang, it's most likely gonna be log bait, but let's fight. Let's wait and see. Um, the archers are gonna take care of that knight. He's gonna decide to log my archers, which is pretty interesting. We can just drop off skeletons for that knight. That electro, um, that electro spirit didn't chain up to my archers, which is good. We can drop off hog and knight. And earthquake is inferno tower once he decides to drop it off now. And the goblin gang as well. Yep. And we are looking in a good position right now. We made him waste more Elixir with the Knight there. He did not want to waste that much Elixir to defend that Hog Push. But now we can just drop off Archers for that Knight once again. And protect the Archers even longer with Skeletons. And that Princess is going to be able to shoot at my Archers from the long distance. But we can destroy that Princess with the Knight once, she, once she's about to shoot our Tower. Which is now. And if he drops Goblin King we can protect her. But it looks like... He's going to decide to go with the Goblin, bro. But yeah, right now we are looking in a hot spot right now. Yes, sir. He dropped off Goblin King. Does he have enough for Inferno Tower? He does not have enough for Inferno Tower. So that's fire for us. That is so good for us, guys. And and once again, rinse and repeat, guys. Drop off Archers for his Knight. Get, protect our Archers even longer with Skeletons. 
And we are looking in a hot spot right now, folks. We are looking in a hot spot right now. Yeah, the princess is going to shoot at my archers once again. And we can kill her. And yeah, we can kill his princess with our knight again of our own. But this time cycle to our knight and then log his goblin barrel. He tried to trick me there. Yo, little B. You can't trick me there, man. <laughs> I've been playing the game for four years, brother. You cannot trick me, my guy. Nah, I'm just playing. But yeah, um, we earthquake down his inferno D. Oh, yeah, um, yeah, his Inferno Tower, but his Inferno Tower should be out of cycle now. So let's go all in with Goblins. I mean, with our Knight and Hogwarts. He's most likely going to rocket this. If I were him, I would rocket it, but it looks like he's not going to decide to rocket it. Wait, does he have rocket in this deck? Because he hasn't used his rocket one one time in this match. Prediction Princess right now? Yes, sir. Drop off Archers to clean up that Princess. Drop off a Hog Rider. Log his Goblin Barrel. And Earthquake is, Earthquake is Inferno Tower. We just need one more earthquake to finish off the game. And this is looking like a good game, man. Good game, um, little B. Thank you so much for participating in this Lester against subs. We can just drop off another hog rider. Cycle back to another log. And cycle back to another earthquake. Yeah, he already knows it's over. Hog will get off one shot. And that will be the end of this match against little B. One more match, guys. One more match against my last subscriber for this. Or yeah, look, the last person of this clan. Ericsson is gonna go on against me so let's get ready for Ericsson let's use this minor wall breakers deck or which deck have oh this sparky mother witch that we haven't used this sparky mother witch deck so Ericsson is the last opponent of the video and yeah man let's um let's give Ericsson the good luck and the thumbs up and this man is already crying why are you crying Ericsson come on bro believe in yourself you can actually beat me like what happened with Freddy and um who was the other guy that beat me? Oh, Darth Vardar. Come on, Ericsson. You got this, brother. Bro, I suck at the game, bro. Like, I'm not good at the game, man. Come on. <laughs> but, yeah, we can cycle the Sparky in. This man is going to have Knight and Goblin. So, he's most likely going to have a Log Bay deck too, right? If I'm not mistaken, right, guys? Or no? What do you guys think? That he's going to have Log Bay or no? We can drop off a Goblin a goblin Giant Prediction Inferno Tower. For, oh, he's going to have Bomb Tower. Bomb tower instead of that, okay. Sparky might get on the tower if Sparky is lucky enough. Come on. Ooh, he's going to drop off Ice Spirit in the last second. Sparky could still shoot the tower, guys. Come on. Oh, let's go. Let's get it, guys. Sparky shot on the tower. We can drop off Spirit Goblins to get a little bit of chip damage more. And yeah, guys. This is not looking good for Ericsson, bro. Ericsson, come on, man. This is not looking good for you, bro. You can totally still beat me, man. Like the other people, bro. Like Freddy and the other guy, Darth. Darth man, bro, how did I lose those matches? I had those matches in the bag, bro. But it's all good, good game to them, and I'm not gonna brag about nothing. Yeah, like, I'm not gonna complain here. Oh no, I'm gonna take the L. And I know that I played bad in those games, cause I, cause yeah, look, I don't usually play like that, but I played horrible. But it's just to have fun, you know. It's just to have fun, you know. But yeah, we can lining down the executioner and bomb tower. The mother witch will finish off the execution and make a hog from that. A, a little piggy, yes sir. And that will be tower for Ericsson. Unfortunately, this is looking like a loss, Ericsson. I ain't gonna lie about that, but you never know in Clash Realm and you can always come back. But yeah, we just gonna have to psycho, psycho Spirit Goblins in the other side on the left side. And Ericsson is already calling the good game, guys. Ericsson is already calling the good game. Come on, Ericsson. You don't believe in yourself, my guy? <laughs> Mother Witch for the night. We can also drop out. Oh, okay. He's going to whip out a Roar Giant. Okay. Yeah, this guy's laughing. <laughs> Yo, Ericsson, look, I told you, man. It's never over. You're going to get a little damage there. Yes, sir. <laughs> but now the Mother Witch is just going to make on. He's just going to keep on making piggies, which is not good for Ericsson, but it's all good, you know. We can lightning down the Bomb Tower and Executioner once again. And yeah, man, that will be good game, Ericsson. Good game. Thank you for participating in this Lester against subs. And yeah, man. I know you couldn't win, but it's all good, brother. We're going to get the two crown. Pick up the easy dub, right? <laughs> Psycho the Mother Witch. He's going to drop off a RG. Wait, guys. I should have let him take out my tower. Yeah, look. I'm going to let him. I'm not going to do nothing. I'm not going to do nothing about that, guys. Let's see if we can take it out. But we have to two crown him. Yeah, with two seconds left, there is no way he's taking out my tower. That will finish off this match. And that will wrap up things. Five matches. Five subscribers joined this clan. Big shout out to Freddy and Darth Darts for for being able to beat me. I had those matches. I still can't get through those matches, bro. 
Let's give our clanmates the G. I mean, my subscribers, GGs. Thank you guys for participating. Participating. Much love. But yeah, guys, that will finish off the video today, guys. Once again, a big shout out to all of these people: Erickson, Darth, um, Darth, Little B, uh, Peter, um, Freddy. Thank you, all of you guys. Thank you guys for joining this clan, and it was something to you know to have fun and versus my subscribers, man. Unfortunately, I did lose two matches, and yeah, guys. Um, if you guys want to see a part two of this, make sure to leave it down in the comments down below. I actually enjoyed playing against my subscribers, guys. I ain't gonna lie. But yeah, guys, other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys did, please make sure to leave a like. Subscribe to this channel if you are new. 1,000 subscribers is the next goal, guys. So come on, guys. Subscribe to my channel if you are new. And other than that, guys, I hope all of you guys have an amazing, wonderful rest of your day. Keep on spreading those positive vibes. Keep on having that positive mentality. And other than that, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next one. I can never ever find the right words And there's no way this is real life There's no telling you're the right girl So I can only say that it feels right It feels right, it feels right Yeah, I can only say that it feels right